In this lecture, we gives the proof of fundamental theorem of R homomorphism. Okay. So first of all, the statement of this theorem. So let us F be an R homomorphism of an R module M on to an R module N. Then M quotient kernel of F is isomorphic to N. Okay. Now in our textbook, he, we have using this notation for isomorphism. Okay. So we can write M quotient kernel of F is isomorphic to N. So this is our first statement in which we have considered F is an R homomorphism from M onto N. Okay. Here it is onto. This is the first statement. Uh, uh, for this theorem, second statement also can be given as let F be an R homomorphism of an R module M into R module N. Okay, here it is into. Then M quotient kernel of F is isomorphic to image of M. Okay. I have to onto relation up with you, onto R homomorphism up with you. Like a F ni image as a yaki. N थाई जासे, ओके? तो M quotient kernel of F is isomorphic to N. आउ आपड़े कई सके? अवे आया, into R homomorphism आपेलू छे. Into R homomorphism असे, त्यारे, F नीजे image असे, E आखी N थासे नहीं. एले के आने जारे, onto आपड़े R homomorphism तरीके consider करसू, त्यारे आया N ने बटले सूँ आउसे, F of M like a image of M. So M quotient kernel of F is isomorphic to image of M. Okay. On to us at yare wall N house and a jare into us at yare kali image of M house. Okay. So come to on to a tiara image chay soon thay jase end thay jase at lapidari te luck hello chay. Okay. अब आपने एग्जाम में क्यों स्टेटमेंट लखूं तो अतिरेक में हूं प्रूफ आपने पहला स्टेटमेंट नहीं आप ये अच्छे ओके पहला स्टेटमेंट नहीं प्रूफ ओके प्रूफ बेनी सेम अच्छे पर ना ये इन टू तरीके लगे तो इमेज कंसीडर करवानी अने ऑन टू तरीके लगे तो एन कंसीडर करवानो तो आपने ऑन टू वालू रखिया आपने सुन बता रहूँ छे M quotient kernel of F is isomorphic to N, ओके? Okay? Isomorphism बता रहूँ इसलिए कि R homomorphism बता रहूँ पर से क्या थी क्या नहीं तो कि M quotient kernel of F to N नो पची one one हो जाए या ने on two हो जाए। So let us consider the quotient map G from M quotient kernel of F to N. How we can define defined by G of M plus kernel of F is equal to F of M. Okay. Where M plus kernel of F is the element of M quotient kernel of F. Okay. R it aapne ek map define kairo. Ave so batar so to ke aapelo me aapne jya G map define kairo chhe. E 1 1 chhe, 1 2 chhe ane R homomorphism chhe. So first we saw that this map G is R homomorphism. Okay. Then given map G is well defined. This is verification. It is up to you to check map G is well defined. Now first we saw that G is R homomorphism. So let us consider two element A is equal to M plus kernel of F and B is equal to N plus kernel of F belongs to M quotient kernel of F. Our domain math B element consider kaira where M and N belongs to R module M. Okay. Now G of A plus B is equal to G of M plus kernel of F plus N plus kernel of F. Now, this M plus kernel of F and N plus kernel of F, we get the M plus N plus kernel of F. We have, it is known, okay? So, G of M plus N plus kernel of F. Now, by the definition of G, G of M plus N plus kernel of F means F of M plus N. Now f of f is an R homomorphism. It is already given. F is an R homomorphism from M onto N. So f of M plus N is equal to f of M plus f of N. Okay. This is equal to now uh, 
f of m we can write as g of m plus kernel of f and f of n we can write as g of n plus kernel of f okay now m plus kernel of f is equal to a and n plus kernel of f is equal to b so we get the g of a plus g of b hence we get g of a plus b is equal to g of a plus g of b so first condition for the homomorphism is satisfied now the second is let element r belongs to ring r now g of r a is equal to g of r what is the value of a is equal to m plus kernel of f now again the for a quotient module defined binary operation g of r m plus kernel of f okay now g of r m plus kernel of f by the definition f of r m quotient map ni definition pramane ane barabar shu lakhi saki f of r m is equal to r f of m okay now g of r a is equal to f of r m now f is r homomorphism so it can be written as r f of m now f of m can be written as so this equal to r now f of m is equal to g of m plus kernel of f from the definition of quotient map okay so g of m plus kernel of f means r g of a so g of r a is equal to r g of a so both the condition for the r homomorphism is satisfied so this shows that g is an r homomorphism now we saw that g is onto so note that f is an onto map f is here f is an onto map and also g is defined as what is the now f is onto map hence g is also onto map so here note that f is an onto map this implies that g is an onto map so g is an onto r homomorphism okay so what we have seen g is an r homomorphism also g is a onto map okay now only requirement is g is one one so to prove g is one one let us consider two element a is equal to m plus kernel of f b is equal to n plus kernel of f belongs to m quotient kernel of f where m and n belongs to r module m now our aim is to show that g is one one so first we have consider images of these two element are same m okay so image of a and b are same so g of a is equal to g of b in last we have so that in last we will show that a is equal to b so first of all consider uh, image of these two element are same so g of a is equal to g of b this implies that what is the g of m plus kernel of f is equal to g of n plus kernel of f okay this implies that now ap ap apply the definition of quotient map f of m is equal to f of n okay next now f of m is equal to f of n this implies that f of m minus f of n is equal to 0 this gives that now f is again r homomorphism so f of m minus n is equal to 0 okay because f is an r homomorphism okay is the reason so now again the definition of kernel of f so m minus n belongs to kernel of f okay so have a i element chai kernel ma chhe to enu quotient space ma apne jasu to m minus n plus kernel of f gives the zero bar okay so a element at set ma hoy to m minus n no quotient space uh, sorry equivalence class m minus n plus kernel of f shu thase zero no equivalence class thase b na equivalence class same thase so ana upar thi shu made तो के m प्लस कर्नेल ऑफ f आ n आ साइड जासे तो इज इक्वल टू n प्लस कर्नेल ऑफ f ओके नाउ m प्लस कर्नेल ऑफ f इज इक्वल टू n प्लस कर्नेल ऑफ f बट दिस इज इक्वल टू a एंड दिस इज इक्वल टू b सो g इज 1 1 वी हैव कंसीडर टू फॉर दिस टू एलिमेंट इमेजेस आर सेम सो वी गेट द 
these two element are also same so our map g is 1 1 so thus we have proved that map g from m quotient kernel of f to n is n 1 1 and onto r homomorphism okay so g is 1 1 onto r homomorphism this implies that g is n r isomorphism from m quotient kernel of f on to n okay r homomorphism plus 1 1 means r isomorphism from m quotient kernel of f on to n this implies that m quotient kernel of f is isomorphic to n hence the proof this gives the proof of our theorem that is the most imp theorem which is fundamental theorem of r homomorphism gives as if f is an r homomorphism from r module m onto r module n then m quotient kernel of f is isomorphic to n okay apade aa statement nu proof apelu che second statement ma into aavse ane n ni jagya e image of m aavse okay pan onto r homomorphism consider karsu etle image is equal to n thai jase ओके तो जी आपने फर्स्ट स्टेटमेंट से अनुप्रूफ आप लोग छे मोस्ट आईएमपी थी अरम छे ओके बराबर समझिए ना याद रख लिया जो बस अबे नेक्स्ट लेक्चर में भी जो आधी अरम विषय नहीं आगर निकोलो कोरोलरी छे अने अमुक एग्जाम्पल छे ये आपने जोस थैंक यू